back again to play with Peter. That's gross. Tails is joining me ever so uh, <coughs> kind of him to do so. And here is where, uh, you know how I was talking about how I'm going to look like an idiot? Um, well, hey. Actually, you know what? I had not intend to demonstrate it that quickly. However, now you know. Uh, I was just going to talk about how I'm... Like, seriously, like... This is just unkind. I don't want to go that way, obviously. Oh, I wanted the shield. Like, uh, I, whatever. Uh, yeah. At least I didn't get hit again. Like, like you could under... When you see me flounder badly in this level, please. Um. Please, uh, just feel for me, alright? Because this is... It's extremely disorienting. Surely you can see, you could, you can appreciate that. Ah, crap. Oh, good. Oh, boy. An upside down one of those things that throws you in whatever. Oh, well, hey, you know, down there. Um, yeah, ah. Oh, please don't let this end up being one of those long things where I die a bunch of times in a row like an idiot. Okay. This will be the time. This is the third time's a charm. No, it's not. You know, the origination of the phrase third time's a charm, I, I, I kind of want to look into because quite frankly, I have learned uh, through, oh uh, my god, through playing Sonic the Hedgehog that the third time is not a charm. At 60 lives, I had like a lot more than that. And uh, I'm down in the 50s? Well, yes, that is typically what happens when you subtract one from 60. Fuck. Oh, great. Okay, this is gonna be the time. This is gonna be uh, the time and the place, whatever the stupid Dave Cook lyrics are. That awful song by uh, American Idol winner Dave Cook. It was the time. All I had to do was mention um, Dave Cook, apparently. He's like a lucky charm. In the American Idol uh, season he was in, I literally, uh, I like hated him. I instantly hated him. The moment I saw him singing and saw his uh, everything about him, I literally just, I hated him. And I said, I said to my family, which I was watching the show with, I said, I hate this guy and he's going to win. He was not even done singing in his audition yet. He hadn't gotten through I don't remember if they let him do two songs or, or uh, just did one. But I could say this. Uh, if it was one, it would... Or if it was two, it was the first song. I called it. I literally called it. I called it. I knew he was winning. And I hated him. It took me less than... Uh, why am I still talking about this? I guess it, it's, I think I'm playing a little, I, like I'm not really paying attention. I started talking about uh, Dave Cook and, and people that I don't like, I, I tend to be able to talk to better, or talk about better than, um, you know, sucking at a video game. 
which this level is basically just makes me look like I'm terrible at the game. So I might as well distract you with my talk about Dave Cook from American Idol season, like, whatever. Why do they give you the... What? What's the point of those? Those are, like, supposed to be, like, you choose to go up or down, and, like, they give you one choice. So it's not really a choice, it's like, oh, you have to stay here until you press the button we want you to press. Magnetic shield. It's the way to go when you're in a, a technologically oriented area. Okay, good, I'm going back down to the floor, I think. The boss in this level, whenever I get to it, is, um... Oh, great. The boss? I'm just gonna get hurt. I don't even care. This is what I was going to do last time. And you know what? It paid off, because I was gonna wait a long time, and I don't want to wait. This boss is not really, um, that difficult by any means, really. Although I will say... Come on. Hit him. Come on. Oh. Come on, just hit him. You gotta hit him with these things that you uh, screw around with the gravity and it... Um, and it misses him. Come on now. Oh. Why? Hit him, hit him, hit him. Ugh. And like, the thing is, is I don't really... Like, it seems like... Seems like it should hit him, like, almost every time. And then, like, one of them stupid blows up. What, you can't hit him from the top? No, you can't. No, what? Like, wh these these things explode. Like, it shouldn't matter if the spikes are there. See that? I guess you have to hit him from the bottom. Which I did. I got him there. Don't hit it. Oh, I wanted that to go under him so I could easily... Okay, this is gonna work. Yes. Okay. Oh, I did not time that well. This is a long and laborious, stupid... Like, this is... This is just... I guess this, like... In terms of self-defeating... Again, Robotnik not really the best in the world. I mean... If he wanted me to not be able to destroy this... Uh, he would just have to have it so that there was no gravity switches in the room. Like, there's... I couldn't go between the different gravities. I couldn't end up on the ceiling. And if that were the case, there's literally no way for me to stop this boss at all. There's no possible um, destruction. Nothing. But stupid Dr. Robotnik, he doesn't care about, you know, being actually, you know, good at stopping you. He builds these inventions and places them in inconvenient locations. He, um, ends up, like, half of the time damaging his own stuff by design. It's ridiculous. Oh, okay. 
chase you and your stupid... Oh boy. Okay, you're gonna grab me. Fortunately, I know a little trick. This. See how it grabs down, you have to jump down on it, and you have to time it well. Yep, that's right, spin dash. Doesn't even hurt you. He's like, oh, I'll get you. But if you have a spin dash going, he won't get you. He won't even kinda get you. See? Like, I am literally just taking this guy apart. Come on, just you, try to hit me. Just try it. Do you see that? See how easy that was? I am running out of time though. Okay, now I have no rings. And now I'm dead. Might as well stop here. I'll have to play it again. That'll have to be for the final video in the entire Sonic 3 and Knuckles Sonic and Tails playthrough. So if you want to see that, click like. We have no options for coin slots. We've got uh, no controllers hooked up to it. You're going to have to press like. It's like one of the only buttons. Top left corner, you'll notice an up arrow. That'll take you to the playlist if you want to check out any of the other videos from this playthrough. On the right side, you'll see a bunch of buttons that'll take you to the latest videos on all of my other channels, as well as help you subscribe to this one if you haven't already. Down in the description, you'll notice Peterific links, such as an Amazon link to purchase this game in a collection called Sonic Collection. Yeah, that's right. On any of the various systems that you might own. More important links as well, such as my Twitter and my Facebook. I'm incredibly thankful for any time you click any of those links. It's awesome, as well as you. You yourself are awesome for watching this. Thank you very, very much. The final Sonic 3 and Knuckles Sonic and Tails playthrough video tomorrow. See you then.